Okay, this is a, uh, a setup that uh, Tim's Vermeer uh, trick used. However, I changed it a little in, because uh, it was too hard to access the uh, image. You had to bend over and get right up, uh, right up top of it. So what I did was I, ra I rotated the whole uh, gizmo toward me up to 45 degrees as you can see. So it makes it, makes it easier to uh, see the uh, image through the mirror. And as you can see the, uh, the pad where the paint goes is also rotated towards me. You can get a better angle here where I've uh, uh, rotated it, like I say, uh, towards me about 45 degrees. It's adjustable from about 15 degrees to 45 degrees. Right now it's about 40 degrees. And uh, I do that by uh, an adjustable uh, sliding arm there. You can see I just tighten it with wing nuts and uh, it just slides out and slides back in and I can adjust the uh, angle but it makes it it makes it a whole lot easier to uh, paint on and uh, then uh, the uh, mirror arm is adjustable also I can uh, move it around anywhere I want in and out or up and down it has quite a uh, an area that I can uh, adjust it to so anyway uh, I call this uh, Tim's Vermeer uh, to coin, coin the phrase. I'm not a painter, so uh, I'm going to attempt to uh, paint uh, that picture right there is uh, actually my mom. And uh, <coughs> um, I'm not a painter, so uh, I'll follow up with a video. If it comes out at all, we'll test uh, Tim's theory that a non-painter can use this device and and paint we shall see so there you go